it's a quick um, quick video on how to break down a Dan Wesson 911 1911 uh, the legendary Dan Wesson um, grandson of the uh, Wesson from Smith and Wesson fame he went off and created his own company um, this is the Guardian has the bobbed handle for easier concealed carry. It doesn't print as much. Has the nice wood grips with the DW logo. Let's see if we can get a good shot of that. It has the uh, beaver tail. Hammer. It has um, awesome Trigicon night sights within the um, back and the front that line up quite nicely and safety check for everybody in video land so they can feel safe and enough of this let's take it down okay so what you got here is your slide stop and there's this little half moon shape right there that you want to align back here but what I like to do is to remove the tension so there's a spring under here I like to do that first and then I do it last when I reassemble it okay so press down this button Turn to the left, and the the bolt spring uh, cover comes off. And then the bushing, you turn again to the other side. I should just put the safety on, so it won't slide around. Um, and then what you do is, it, there's this little tab when you turn it that way that allows it to unlock and come out this can be stubborn so there's the bushing basically there's a little half moon shape here you bring it back and what you do is on the other side is the other is this little round thing right here and basically what you do is you line up the half moon shape. Uh, it's a little bit easier to see. All right. Focus. Right there. What you want to do is line that up with the slide stop here. You'll see that little half moon shape also is in alignment. And there's a, it's a little bit of a sweet spot, but basically you push on the little button here for the slide stop and it comes off like so now what you have here is a way to remove the slide so it comes off like that so now you have this the frame slide stop bolt spring cover and now you have the slide with the spring that comes out and also the barrel which comes out the front and so it's kind of locked in at the end so you push up and it comes right out so a little bit more difficult than some of the other guns like a sig or um, a glock but it's kind of like a puzzle i think it's kind of cool i like um, taking it apart and putting it back together